Hello there, my name is Ben Price. It's uh, February of 2017. And today we're going to take a look inside the uh, uh, low frequency uh, uh, folded horn enclosure for the PV Project 2. This is, this is the FH1. So here's one that's put together. Uh, back up a little bit. And then uh, we have one in front of me here that's I just I've just taken apart. So here's the it's upside down, but that's the front of it. And I took the bottom off. The bottom is just a flat piece of wood that covers it covers off the entire uh, bottom area with some, some metal feet on it. Actually, it's hard to see, but it's sitting right there. So let's take a look inside and, and see what we have. Um, there's a, a, a PB 15 inch uh, Black Widow speaker. I guess it's upside down, so it's kind of hard to read what it says. Maybe I can stick this in there and see it. Again, I, I even can't see what the screen says at this point, but maybe uh, wipe that off. There, try that. So ho hopefully we'll be able to see something there. But this is the uh, the PV 15-inch. Uh, um, it says its model here on the on this right where my end of my finger is. There's a sticker. It says model 1502. Uh, impedance 4 ohms and uh, Black Widow. So as you can kind of see, uh, and again this is actually the back of the unit here with the uh, two parallel uh, plugs, quarter inch uh, plugs or jacks. Uh, the uh, speaker is kind of rear loaded so it's firing, uh, firing toward the back of the unit. It looks like this compartment that it's in is completely sealed. I don't see any uh, any holes or any ports or anything here so this part we're in at the moment would be some sort of compression uh, uh, provide some sort of compression to the unit and then the front front of the speaker fires into this uh, horn assembly Ugh, I can tilt this over that kind of looks like that and the my, yeah and again it's kind of tough to see but if you look back in here there's a oh, uh, oh I'd say that's probably about a three to four inch opening that goes vertically all the way up and down the sides of this uh, the, this unit. Let me look at the other unit, maybe it'll be a little easier to see. So in, in this unit, the one that's put together, if we were to look in, in to the back, there would be about a four inch opening vertically going up and down all the way to the, to the bottom. This is just a structural piece here. So we'll go from the bottom to the top on both sides. And then the front of that uh, 15 inch speaker fires toward the rear, gets uh, brought back to the front. So that's kind of what it looks like. Uh, this particular speaker uh, looks to be in good shape. I don't see any uh, uh, particular problems with them. This system is from the 80s, I believe. I don't have a actual um, a manufacturer date on it, but uh, this is this stuff has been around for a while. I'm pretty excited to have this. Uh, I'm, I played a classic country band here. We're, we'll be using this for some of our larger venues, and it, I've already hooked it up and tested them out and they sound just fantastic. The uh, connections are via these uh, uh, push uh, push posts here. Let's see if I can do this. So just push these little pins and, uh, and the wire falls out. The uh, gauge of the wire is you know, fairly small. This is rated at, a, I think it's 350 watts RMS. So the wires are Starting to get a little bit on the slow on the small side, but it's it seems to be fine again I've had it hooked up and played it at fairly moderate. I'm in my house here. I played it at fairly moderate levels uh, Which is to say loud and it sounds great sounds fantastic. So that's what we've got today. This is the inside of the uh, the uh, PVFH1 uh, which is the uh, low frequency enclosure for the uh, PV project 2 uh, PA unpowered PA system and there's what, uh, there's what one side kind of looks like. So if you have any questions about this or any other things you'd be interested in knowing about this, uh, this amazing, uh, amazing old system, by all means, uh, get in touch with me and we'll, uh, we'll see if we can't work this out. Hope you all have a great day. Bye now.